have been gone for a little while. It's been like two and a half to three weeks. I don't know what happened. I got really busy and there's a lot of stuff going on and I just didn't have any time to film and upload and when I did have time I was so lazy and didn't want to get ready and even to myself I was like you can film without makeup it's not a big deal but then I still didn't want to get up and do it. It's weird though because I always want to film and I always want to talk to you guys and make videos and for some reason I was just so exhausted for the past couple weeks that I just couldn't do anything. And here I am now. I have a boxy charm to show you for August. I actually have a ton of boxes like piled up because like I said I hadn't been filming so I have a lot of catching up to do with you guys and we're gonna start with boxy time. Black box. A few of you said that yours are still white, which I find a little odd, but um, that's okay. Let's go ahead and open this up. It's really full. This is what it looks like inside. We are going to just go ahead and start pulling stuff out. At first I thought this was a Tarte Cosmetics Look Cream Lip Cream, but it's not. It's by So Susan and it is something for your skin. Let us find out. Oh, it's a highlighting crown. <laughs> um, it is a... <laughs> I can't, I have been coughing so much because I started um, running. I don't know if I told you guys. I don't think I did. I actually suck at running. I hate running so much, but I have, um, but I have sports induced asthma. So I have been coughing nonstop. I have a couple inhalers that I'm on right now trying to just like work it out of me. But uh, yes, I have been running and I probably will be coughing a little bit during the video because too much air like it doesn't feel like I have enough air in my lungs and then I'm just start <laughs> like I want to cough right now um this is a crown though and it is a highlighting crown and let's go ahead and I think it's, yeah it's broken in there I th this is what it looked like when it came out it must have popped up which eh, I mean it's a ooh, that's actually really pretty this is a really pretty like inner corner highlight and like above your brow bones I'll have to try to fix that um worst case though I can always just pot it and like put it in something else this retails for $20 it's called the statement skin and yeah it is a highlighter the next thing is from mica or mica beauty cosmetics and it is a gel eyeliner in black I used to use gel eyeliner all the time I have been using the markers lately can't say that I won't get back into this though because this is so pigmented like if you want a straight black pigment on your eyes this is probably a good thing to try out so is the marker though the only good thing about the marker is that you don't have to wash your brushes as much but i will for sure use this that retailed for 35 dollars that is one expensive gel eyeliner oh my goodness what the heck i didn't see this before and now i just saw it and i am so excited we got the revealed three palette by coastal sense we've gotten the one and two i didn't even know there was a three out <laughs> like, oh. um okay i need to open this right now i don't know how i didn't see it when i opened the box but i literally did not <laughs> i'm an animal when it comes to opening this okay cross your fingers for me that it's not broken it's not Okay, here are all of the shades. We have a bunch of purple and pinks and also a few matte colors too, which those are going to be fun to use. I'm not so much into the purple, but um, fall's coming. I will probably get a little more into eggplant. That one's going to be pretty, I feel like. And I love these two. I love the golds. This is good. I love like it so this retails for $39.95 um it didn't say on the card that it also is on sale for $19.95 so you can probably pick it up for that on the coastal since website this is, has to be my favorite thing in here and I don't even know what the rest of the stuff is Noi Nules Shield Style Protect Leave-In Conditioner and it has natural shine with Moroccan Argon Oil SPF 15 for your scalp and has frizz control, sunburn shield, which I do tend to get sunburn on my scalp, um, and then hair color and texture protectant, gin protection. Um, I like, oops, um, 
there's tape on there i like i know this is a weird thing to be like oh it's so cool is the silver cap of the bottle i think that just looks a little more elegant than your normal ones less plasticky even though like pretty positive but yeah that's still plastic i just like the silver on it I am an oddball when it comes to packaging. Uh, I can always use leave-in conditioner. I use it every single time I come out of the shower. I'll spray it from my ears down. There's not one certain leave-in conditioner that I have to use, so I'm completely open to trying new things when it comes to my hair. And that retails for, let me guess, I'm gonna say like 19 it's not it retailed for 26 dollars and then the very last thing is this eyeliner brush which makes sense because you can use the gel eyeliner with this so that's kind of cool that they put it in there it makes it easier if you get a product and then like you get something that complements it so i'm assuming that's why they did it but this is a really pretty color i technically won't be using this for the eyeliner though because this is not the type of brush that i use i like an angled eyeliner brush and very thin um, and this actually could be a good lip brush too, but at the same time I don't use lip brushes. I'll probably just give this to a friend. It's by Seta, and again, the color Tiffany Blue, that is really pretty. And that retailed for $16. So, overview real fast. My favorite thing, obviously the eyeshadow palette. Like, anyone that says differently, I'm not judging you, but concerned. What? Why? I don't get it. Um, and least favorite is going to go to the brush because, like I said, I really don't have anything that I can use this for. Um, I will try to think of something, maybe even nail art, but at the same time, I feel like someone can probably get more use out of it for its intended rule. So I'll probably just give it away, like I said. That is everything. I promise I'll be back. I'm sorry if you felt like I had abandoned you. I'm sure you didn't, but... Um, I'm still on YouTube and I'm still doing videos and I love you guys and I will be back soon with another video. Again, the question and answer is still coming, I promise, and um, I didn't get that many questions, but I have a lot to tell you anyways and I'm gonna get through it all. I, <laughs> I don't know how many times I can promise you that, but I swear I am and I will just see you guys really soon. Goodbye. I need to read you. Goodbye. It's a weird goodbye. Um. Goodbye. That's all so weird. Uh, um, I'll awkwardly wave at you now.